Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome to the bonus episode of Let's Play Hollow Knight. It all comes down to this one final ending that we have left. And to get this, you have to progress a ways into the game and have the spore shroom equipped and find a certain character in seven locations in a specific order. Nice you were able to help your friends so you're not hungry anymore? Yes, that was quite the appetite. I was impressed. Still, we all move on sooner or later to greater things, perhaps. So much can be achieved in just a, uh, such a short time. Excuse me. There is a series of hints on a tablet in Kingdom's Edge if you don't know where to look for Mr. Mushroom. Uh, the second location is just here in uh, Kingdom's Edge. The first one was in the Fungal Wastes. And you do have to do them in this sequence. Shouldn't trust the eye they gave you. Rely on your own instincts. If you've got a keen nose, use it. And while you're hunting for secrets, beware those who are hunting you. Excuse me. If you don't have the sports room equipped, uh, they come off as just nonsensical ramblings. The dead can't make use of wealth in any case. What would they spend it on? He has a big brood like that, they need food and shelter and toys. If you keep some for yourself, well, I think you deserve it. Yes. Even so, even with the sports room, it still comes off as pretty rambly. Like he's talking past you, or not to you at all sometimes. And this next one is in the Howling Cliffs, right near the Nailmaster. What was called a hero in its moment may be called something very different after time has passed. The crimes and triumphs of our predecessors echo all around us, don't they? The chains of fate that bind us all together, do you really want to break them? I love you, Mr. Mushroom. You are the best. Second best after Pibby. Now here in the Ancient Basin, I was kind of a dunce and forgot to hit record, so pretty big shout out and thanks to Hold the Reset here uh, for the footage of the Ancient Basin dialogue. Well, if things are getting too dangerous down there, maybe it's time to take a break. Come back up and spend some time hunting or gathering or wandering aimlessly. No, not too much longer now. Then we have this and... Ah, uh, the Queen's Gardens. Actually, it's, uh... This is, I think, technically Fog Canyon. First, let's dream nail them. Worms pull bugs into their thrall till ages pass and kingdoms fall. Caps and shells may fall to dust, but Mr. Mushroom readjusts. I haven't seen her, no. I'm sure you'll remember where you left her eventually. Trust the moon, or yourself, or trust her. You need to trust something. That's my point. Hmm. No, not him. No, absolutely not. Excuse me. And this is the last one. I'm the King's Pass of the Howling Cliffs. Right where we start the game. Did I say ye? I think I was trying to combine we and you. It's not by tools that you'll triumph. It's through your smarts, your speed, and your determination. Oh, I see. So you've been following me around then? I hope my travels haven't confused your own and distracted you. Then again, a meander journey still has meaning. It is, after all, from a journey we find our purpose. Though a stop is more than just a stop. And my, if those stops can't be lovely things, wouldn't you say? Transcendent plateaus, distant sandy lands, vast ancient kingdoms. Yours was not the first, nor will it be the last. But it's a unique and special thing, nonetheless. Now, with my duties here finished, it's time I made graceful departure. Till next time, my friend. Tis a long road we tread, but a joyous one. Until our paths cross again.
Now the final step is to beat the game, watch past the initial ending that you get, and watch past the credits for something very special. Our little bonus Easter egg ending. It's like the Silent Hill uh, UFO or dog endings. <laughs>